Hey, have you heard about how AI is being used to improve English skills? Yeah, I've heard a bit about it, but I'm curious to learn more. How can AI really help with English learning? One of the most common ways is through language learning apps and platforms. AI-powered chatbots and virtual tutors can provide real-time feedback on pronunciation, grammar, and vocabulary. Yes, I have heard about it, but how accurate is the feedback from these AI systems? It's improving rapidly. AI can analyze your speech patterns and compare them to native speakers, giving you more personalized and accurate feedback over time. Wow, I cannot believe that. But what about writing skills? Can AI help with that? Of course. My friend, AI can assist with writing in many ways like offering grammar and style suggestions. Tools like Grammarly and ProWritingAid use AI to help users improve their written English. That would be so nice if it were available when I was in school. Haha, I am just kidding. Then it will be so useful for non-native English speakers. What else can AI do? You are so funny, my friend. AI can also create custom learning plans. It can identify your weaknesses and strengths and tailor lessons accordingly to improve specific areas. So, it's like having a personalized language tutor? Yes, and it's available 24-7. AI doesn't need breaks. True. But I assume AI can't replace human teachers entirely, right? You are making a point, dude. AI can't replace human interaction and cultural nuances. However, it can complement traditional teaching methods. I think so. What about reading skills? Can AI help with that too? Yes. AI can assist in reading comprehension. Some apps provide text with various difficulty levels and offer vocabulary explanations and quizzes to test your understanding. Oh my god, this is so much better for English learner. But is AI being used in formal education, like schools and universities? Yes. Many educational institutions are incorporating AI tools into their curricula. They use AI for assessment, feedback, and personalized learning plans. This can make education more accessible and efficient. Are there any potential downsides to using AI for language learning? Well, some worry about over-reliance on AI, which might reduce human interaction and creativity. Plus, not everyone has access to AI-powered tools. I see, dude. So it seems AI has a lot to offer in improving English skills. This has been an insightful discussion, dude. Yes, my friend. If you ever decide to try an AI-powered language learning app, let me know. I can recommend a few good ones. I'll consider trying one of those apps. It's amazing how technology has come so far in helping us learn and improve our language skills. Technology has indeed opened up a world of possibilities. And AI keeps getting better so these tools will only become more effective over time. One more thing, my friend. I'm also curious about AI's potential in translating languages. Can AI make translation more accurate and efficient? That is for sure. 
AI powered translation tools like Google Translate has made significant SDRPS in improving translation accuracy. They use neural networks to understand context and nuances better. This is really good for travelers and businesses dealing with international clients. But do you think AI could replace human translators someday? It's a possibility, but there are limitations. AI can be incredibly helpful for quick translations, but for highly nuanced or culturally sensitive content, human translators will likely remain essential. Hmm. AI can assist, but human translators add that human touch. Speaking of which, do you think AI can ever truly understand the nuances of human communication and emotion? AI is getting better at understanding emotions through sentiment analysis and natural language processing. It can be used for customer service and feedback analysis, but it's not on par with human emotional intelligence. Emotions are complex, after all. It's fascinating how AI is making inroads into so many aspects of language and communication. Yes, my friend, and there's so much potential for AI to continue improving our ability to communicate across language barriers and enhance our language skills. It's an exciting time for technology and language learning. If you ever have more questions or want to explore any specific aspect of AI and language, come and ask me, dude. By the way, have you heard about AI generating creative content, like writing stories or poetry in English? Yes, AI has made some remarkable progress in this area. There are AI systems that can generate creative content, and while it may not match the depth of human creativity, it's impressive nonetheless. While I really cannot believe in today's technology, can you recommend any AI-generated pieces of creative writing in English that I can check out? Sure. You might want to look into works like The Policeman's Beard is Half Constructed by a program called Racked and Poetry Generated by GPT-3. These examples showcase AI's creative potential. I'll explore those. It's fascinating to see AI pushing the boundaries of creativity. It is. AI can also be used as a creative writing tool for inspiration and in generating ideas, which can be a valuable resource for writers. Speaking of resources, do you think AI can replace schoolwork? Like student projects, writing research and assignments. That is for sure. But the problem is student will face consequences if they are caught using these AI tools to assist with their work. They can even be terminated from school or get failed immediately. I think so. But what if the students use it in a creative ways like paraphrasing or use it for an idea for their study? This would be possible, I think. Yes. If they use it correctly, it would be so much helpful with their schoolworks and education. In reverse, students will face serious consequences for sure. Aha. Uh -huh. That would also be challenges for the school because they have to detect whether the students use AI tools or not. Yes. But most of the time, if the student use AI to assist their works without correcting on the original, teacher definitely will notice it. Overall, 
it is helpful and practical if we use it correctly and in the right way. Yes, dude. This has been an incredible discussion so far. Goodbye. Friend, have a great weekend. I will see you later.